Kentucky teachers step up their fight against proposed cuts to their retirement benefits. As Megan Moore tells us, several districts participated in demonstrations today pushing to protect education funding. Administrators, even some parents and students participated in the walk-ins today here in Boone County and also Kenton County as well. Outside of the Boone County Board of Education building in Ackerman Elementary and Middle Schools, they lined the road holding signs and chanting this morning. This comes just a couple days after teachers from around the state rallied at the Capitol protesting Senate Bill 1, a proposed pension plan overhaul. But teachers and the Boone County Education Association President Mary Wilson say it's about more than their pension. She says they are pushing for education funding. The governor is now in the process of creating a bill. There is a Senate and a House version also, and it is going to deeply affect cuts to the school district. It could affect personnel, um, resources, especially family youth resources, and those are some programs that are vital to some of these schools and communities in Boone County. It's about budget cuts. It's about what these children need. It's about um, our families are changing. The needs of our families are changing and we feel like we're doing more and more and more with less and less and um, you know we're, we're very dedicated. There are 24 schools in the Boone County School District for those schools that did not participate in the walk-ins this morning. Some were planned after school. Here in Boone County, Megan Moore, Local 12 News. Kentucky's pension system is more than $41 billion short of the money needed to pay benefits over the next 30 years. The state Senate decided not to vote on the proposed cuts earlier this month and sent it back to committee where it currently sits.